at the start of the final race of the day. Pole man Jerome Grosset-Jeanne has plenty to think about behind him. Alex Toy and Samuel Poe who are ready to take advantage of the slightest error. Grosse Jeanne and then leads heading into the opening corner. Poe and Toy are next, followed by Georges Ur, Flip Tolema and Christoph Wilt. Early on, the driver putting on the show is Alex Toy, and he is the only driver able to maintain the pace of the race leader, Grosse Jeanne. On lap two, he sets the fastest lap of the A final in his Golf 4. Leader Grosse Jenner has some rear bumper damage and there's plenty of smoke coming from the tyre that's rubbing against the bodywork. Grosse Jenner doing his best, but his visibility is severely diminished. in that goal, setting the fastest times in this final. George Ure in his Zara is fourth for his first rally cross race. Or has been mightily impressive. Philip Tolema is right behind in fifth and Wilt in sixth. Now leader Grosse Jeannin is under threat from Samuel Po, and we're now in for a fantastic finish in this D1 final. damage to the rear bumper it's creating an awful lot of smoke for those behind <laughs> behind Grosse and Burke can't see much either but he keeps pressuring the leader for the start of the race, the champion leader wants to assure a good points tally, but with just 10 minutes remaining, he now wants nothing but the win. Jean <laughs> grosse Jeanne takes the win, but just barely. Samuel Poe made it close, but in the end had to settle for second. Alex Toy takes third. Georges Ore next in fourth.